you ever wondered who invented the helicopter, that marvelous machine that defies gravity and takes us to the skies? The answer lies in the heart of the late 19th century, with the birth of a genius named Igor Sikorsky. Born in Kiev, then part of the Russian Empire, in the year 1889, Sikorsky's fascination with flight was sparked early on. His imagination took flight, fueled by the fantastic tales of airborne adventure penned by Jules Verne. As a young boy, he began experimenting with model aircraft, his curious mind always eager to understand the mechanics of flight. This passion led him to the city of love, Paris, where he embarked on a formal education at the renowned École des Techniques Aéronautiques. There, Sikorsky immersed himself in the study of aeronautics, honing the skills and knowledge that would one day allow him to build a machine that could conquer the skies. A young man with a dream, Sikorsky set out to conquer the skies. But how did a young man from Kiev end up inventing one of the most versatile flying machines in the world? Well, the journey wasn't exactly a walk in the park. Igor Sikorsky's path to creating the helicopter we know today was paved with challenges, determination, and a vision that refused to be grounded. Moving to the United States in 1919, Sikorsky carried with him not just his belongings, but also his dreams of revolutionizing flight. With the support of fellow Russian emigrants, he established the Sikorsky Aero Engineering Corporation. This was more than just a company. It was a beacon of hope for Sikorsky's ambitious dreams. In the next few years, Sikorsky would focus his efforts on the development of multi-engine airplanes and amphibious aircraft. These endeavors were not without their setbacks, but they also brought significant advancements in the field of aviation. Each failure, each success, was a stepping stone towards his ultimate goal. As the 30s rolled in, Sikorsky began to shift his attention. His eyes were set on a different prize, vertical flight. The concept was not new, but practical implementation had always been a hurdle. Sikorsky, however, was not deterred. He believed in the potential of vertical flight and was willing to stake his reputation on it. For nearly a decade, Sikorsky and his team worked tirelessly, experimenting, refining and testing. Each iteration brought them one step closer to the realization of Sikorsky's dream. Then, in 1942, the world bore witness to a sight it had never seen before. The VS-300, the world's first practical helicopter, took to the skies. Sikorsky's dream had finally taken flight. This moment was more than just a personal victory for Sikorsky. It marked a pivotal point in the history of aviation. The helicopter was no longer just an idea, it was a reality. Sikorsky's relentless pursuit of his dream had led him to create a machine that would forever change the face of aviation. Sikorsky's relentless pursuit of his dream led to the creation of a machine that changed aviation forever. What then became of Sikorsky and his revolutionary invention? Igor Sikorsky's helicopters, first taking flight in the late 30s, became instrumental during World War II. They provided crucial support in rescue missions and transport, proving their worth on an international stage. But the story doesn't end there. The Sikorsky Aircraft Corporation, founded by Sikorsky himself, continues to be a leading manufacturer in the industry, pushing the boundaries of aviation technology. Sikorsky's genius wasn't limited to helicopters, though. He also contributed significantly to the development of the turboshaft engine a power unit that revolutionized aircraft design. And let's not forget his conceptualization of the rescue hoist, a device that has saved countless lives since its inception. The reach of Sikorsky's inventions and innovations extends far beyond the realm of aviation. From rescue missions in treacherous terrains to everyday transport, his legacy continues to impact our lives in ways we often take for granted. In the world of aviation, Igor Sikorsky's legacy soars as high as the machines he created. I know you told your friend you're not okay And tell me what's wrong and why you never said you felt that way And guess you're trying to stay strong and fake a smile until I look away But I've known you too long, it hurts to watch your blue eyes fade to grey as you fade away 